one championship Warriors card in Jakarta, Indonesia was a night of electrifying martial arts action. Michael Chavello, Mitch Chilson with you. Mitch, you kicked off with a belt that sent shockwaves through the Muay Thai world as the little Aussie battler, Josh Tonner, the ticking time bomb, knocked out Andy House on the five-time world champion with a highlight reel KO in the second round. Josh Tona is known as a workhorse, a grinder, but he was able to take that power that he had at flyweight and bring it down to the strawweight division and score a huge knockout in the second round. Josh Tona now with three wins in a row at one Super Series. The one that brought the house down, Indonesian wrestling champion Eko Roni Saputra over Konsep Chan of Cambodia, wrestler versus striker, wrestler versus Kunkamai champion, and Eko Roni Saputra was just awesome. Indonesia has been looking for their next superstar, and I believe we have found it in Eko Rani Saputra. The wrestling champion was able to apply the heat and melt Kong Si Chan with a beautiful submission finish. The sky's the limit for this young man. Speaking of spectacular finishes, we always said it would be the showstopper when Yuri Lapikas took on Marek Gafarov. Lapikas is undefeated. He came in with 11 first round finishes and Mitch, he got another one in a style that nobody could have predicted. We knew this lightweight tilt could steal the show, but nobody could have foreseen the way that it would have ended. Lapikas locked on a rear naked choke against the rear naked choke master in Morat Gafarov. A beautiful display by Lapagus. Yuri Lapagus signaling to the entire lightweight division that he is coming at them in 2020. Then Mitch, our co-main event, Leandro Ataidi took on Rena Dorita at middleweight. The winner of this one would get a world title crack guaranteed at the champion Ong Lan Sung. It was a back and forth contest. It went the full distance. It was an absolute war. And I know Ong Lan Sung is chomping at the bit now to get in there and do battle against Reiner the Ritter. Really showed a different style than he's normally used to. He's used to taking people down and choking them out. But this one was completely different. A back and forth striking battle. He did damage inside the clinch and was able to put hands on Ataidi. And then in our main event for the inaugural featherweight Muay Thai World Championship of one Super Series. Now, Mitch, you know that I'm a Muay Thai guy. I love my Muay Thai. I love good Muay Thai. And I saw one of the best performances I have ever seen tonight. Pet Morikop, Pet India Academy painted a masterpiece against Pong Sari. It was a clinical performance, an absolute master class. The way that Pet Morikot was able to put those combinations together was absolute witchcraft. It was truly something special, and it was an honor to be on the call with you for that to take place. The jab of Pet Morikot, the jab to knee, the jab to elbow, the jab to round kick, he did everything right, and his reign of gold begins. Folks, join us February 28th. We're in Singapore for the King of the Jungle. Stan Fairtex, Janet Todd, and a swathe of superstars are going to descend on Singapore in February.